<laughs> Good morning, people. You know, so I just found my uh, camera lying around in the car. So I decided, why don't I just make another uh, Incredible Life episode today? So, that's what I'm going to do. So, right now, I'm about to go return a little carpet cleaning machine at Walmart. Um, trying to get it in my car first. I forgot that all the water was in the machine, so I spilt it all over my backseat of my car. That's a bitch. This little motherfucker right here. Got it all over the car. All over the freaking car, right here. This is what we gotta do. We gotta dump all this water out first. So just dump all this water out first. That's all that nasty shit. You can't see it. All the shit. I mean, you can't really see it now. Gotta dump it out. But that was all the dirt and shit that was in the carpet. Freaking disgusting. And I gotta dump out the cleaning water. Still got a lot in here that I didn't use. But... Turn it upside down. I'm gonna pour. All right, now let's put this bitch in the car. Uh, please don't get my seat wet. All right. All right, think we good? So today's episode, today's episode is gonna be a solo episode. You know, all the other episodes, one through five, I'm always with people. I'm either with Kenny, either with some of my co-workers. And, you know, I like to film us doing just fun stuff. I don't ever film while I'm alone. So, yeah. Let me go get, uh, let me go take a shower, brush my teeth. So, yeah, let me go take a shower, get ready. I got to return this machine before three. Right now it is. All right, guys, on a Walmart for the real mission. Y'all know what that is. We got to return this little machine in the back. Man, how you doing, sir? Um, man, it's a beautiful day outside. Like, I would hate, I, I'm sorry, but today, if you spend, if you spend it, uh, most of your day inside, man, I feel bad for you. It's, it's, you know, you got, you got light, white, white clouds out, blue sky. Look at this. The, the trees are green. When are the trees ever green? When is the grass ever green? Like, the grass is green. The grass is green on the other side for real. Like, man. Oh my god, we gotta put the ISO down because it's so so bright outside. Just, you know, looking good. So, this is what I'm gonna do. When I get to Walmart, I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go return the machine. I'm gonna bust the drone out. I'm gonna get some drone footage because, like, it's too good. Look, like, people riding their bikes outside, walking their dogs. Like, this is this is this is what the world should look like every single day. It's peaceful, quiet, no bullshit going on. You know, people just just happiness. Just happiness. Just pulled up to Wally World. This is a little Wally World. This is not no super center. See this is a this is a Walmart neighborhood market. It's like a little miniature Walmart. They don't have all the all the cool stuff like games, electronics, TVs, all that good stuff. All that stuff that that we know uh, Walmart for.
nice and easy return. Just put your card in, opens the door, put the machine in, close the door, you're good. I like when things are made simple. When companies make things simple, like renting a, a cleaning machine and returning it, it's going to make people want to come back. Because, you know, you'd be like, oh, I literally returned the thing. Oh, shit. I'm just going to rake. Let me put my seatbelt on. People out here don't know how to drive, man. I'm tripping. Yeah, so, first when I went to go rent the machine, it literally took, like, like two minutes. You put your card in. You select the one you want. Type in... You type in your email, type in your ad, you get your credit card information, you know, to verify your, your billing and shit. And then a uh, door pops open. The machines are right there. The, the door, a door pops open, you take the machine out, boom, take it home. You go do what you gotta do when you're ready to return. And the machine is easy to use too. Not clean, uh, you can clean a whole, whole upstairs carpet in like, like 30 minutes. 30 minutes, so. And then when it, when I went to go return it, the return process literally took like 20, 25 seconds. Alright, this is a good place to fly the drone. So we're going to fly it right here. This little bad boy right here. Edge. Compass error. Alright, no more drone footage for the day. Drone is the battery is completely dead. Well, it's not dead, but it's at like 10% and I just crashed it, so I think that's gonna we're gonna call it a quits. Alright, it is 204. I don't even know what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day. Back at me casa. Uh about to go back inside, so I'm gonna start filming. So I got family up in here. I got some food waiting for me, so I don't really feel like filming. I might just end the episode right here. I know it was, uh, wasn't that exciting of an episode, but, you know, it was something. Solo dolo. I might not. I might have more, so let me get some, let me get some light on me. Get that, get that beautiful face. Yeah, there we go. So, yeah, so, this might be the end. You'll find out in three, two, one. And we still here. Still here, I ain't go nowhere. A matter of fact, they got me, they got me on the uh, on the grill, grill master, grill master. Essential grill items, the Corona Extra. So what we doing over here? All right, man, these burgers are gonna taste so good. I will tell you, man. When I hop on that grill, I go to work. What's up, Marley? Come here, baby. Come here, baby. What's up with you? What's up with you? Come here. Marley. Marley, come here. Man, he, he, he mad at me, man. He, he hate me. Marley, Marley, Marley been hating on me for like a good month now. Does he want to go go shit in the shit in the laundry room? So I had to beat the shit out of him. Now you now you hanging on me, man. He don't he don't fuck with me now. Yo, those burgers were so 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 good, man. It, it got me in a food coma. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this episode short so I can take a nap. So I hope y'all like the episode a little short. It's whatever you know what to do. Like and subscribe. Peace. You turn it. If LeBron won the championship, I will never let any of you watch you motherfuckers live it out. Straight up.